me say about the transition from the old venue to this venue? Well, it's, um, it's been strategic for us, you know. It's like when one door closes, God opens another one. Uh, it's interesting. I feel like we have a chance to even grow more. Uh, I feel a freedom I didn't have in the previous place. Um, and um, everything is coming right and getting better and moving on to the next level. Pastor, I saw something different about communion today. <laughs> yeah, we are, we're, we're just trying to pull down the walls of religion. Uh, we're used to doing it in a particular way and uh, we're challenging the status quo and we're saying, let's do it the Bible way. Communion is a feast, is an ordinance. Uh, people take communion on their field. And we say, all right, let's do it the Bible way. We don't just want the uh, wafer piece and then the small cup wine. We decided to do it like Jesus said, take you all of it, you know. And uh, the bread comes in handy. It's, it's a feast. It, 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 it's a feast and it's going to get better. Uh, I hear of a press train, press train. Just tell yeah, me. press train is our mandate and our commitment commitment of praise. Uh, we've heard of pr uh, a prayer mountain where people pray non-stop and we decided to commit ourselves to a kingdom mandate of a praise and worship chain that will not stop. We've started it, it's on and we're moving it to the next level. All you need to do is take 10 minutes every day within the time block and then everybody's on praise train and we're trying to get the whole church in the world to be a part of it. We just want to give God a non-stop praise and worship and he'll do the rest. Pastor from, from London, it's, it's nice um, associating with Masterpiece. Yeah, thank you very much. Wow, so great to have you guys here. Thank you so much. All right. Thank you.